Hello, everybody. My name is Patrick Dennis with Synaptic Advisory Partners. The last item I'm going to show you is how we can build out sections inside of Eureka uh, that show us uh, different pieces of content or images or instructions. So I'm actually going to add one more section here, and we're going to call this displaying content inside of forms. And the reason why this is so important is when we talk to a lot of different customers, they ask us, you know, how can Eureka help support uh, the talk tracks that my users are going through? So if they're filling out a form while they're talking to a customer or they're filling out a form during an inspection, they don't want to just show questions, but they want to show content. And so that's what we're, I'm going to show you here. So rather than dragging questions onto the canvas, what I'm going to do is actually drag text, image, and space. So this is a different feature that we're going to be able to drag here. And this is just allowing us to be able to indicate whether we want to show free text, or images or just have a blank space. So here I'm going to just say uh, here's your free text and we can edit the text here so we'll just indicate that we want it to be centered etc. And then the other item here is that maybe we want to add an image. A lot of times we have customers adding literally uh, tiny little images with instructions or uh, with images of maybe how things are supposed to look so that when their users are using the form and they're inspecting something, uh, there's an image of the ideal state so they can compare what they're seeing in real life to what is in the, this image that's in the form. So I'm actually just going to pick image here and uh, we're just going to make this easy and make it uh, my own face. How about that? And so uh, we'll just add these images here or this image here and then I'm just gonna add one question here on the right hand side that just says what would you like to see and this will be a radio button uh, again and we'll just call this an image and we'll call this um, free text and then that'll allow us to basically conditionally show these two elements here so we'll indicate the different display logic uh, for free text. So when someone picks they want free text, we'll show that free text. And when someone picks they want an image, they will see my face. If you have any other questions on uh, how to get started with the template builder or, or how to utilize Eureka for your specific use case, you can visit us on the App Exchange or visit our website at eureka.io and we'll be happy to talk to you about how Eureka might be able to work for your business.